few days mm -hmm. today, though, it's more the cold and snow that we're talking about. Right, absolutely. The stronger wind gusts are gone, but it's still a little bit breezy out there, so we're going to stick with wind chills right on through this afternoon. That'll feel about 10 degrees colder than the temperature. Uh, you can see right now we're at 22 degrees. We're mostly cloudy. Around noon, still mostly cloudy and 26. And between now and noon, we expect some flurries or light snow showers. But then after that, the afternoon looks dry. Between 3 and 5, we'll see a little more sunshine, up to 29 for a high. But again, factoring that in that northwest wind coming in between 10 and 15 miles per hour. And wind chills this morning, upper single digits to around 10. Going into the afternoon, the wind chills will remain in the upper teens, even going into the evening hours. So still looking very cold over the next 12 hours. Right now, with 22 degrees, our temperature, a west wind at 12, it does feel like 10 degrees. And we have some snow to go along with it. In Springfield, extending down through Fairborn, Xenia, and back through Vandalia, Dayton, a few flurries falling. Not accumulating, but falling for the morning drive. And with temperatures as cold as they are, we'll still have to watch for an isolated slick spot or two. This moisture really coming off of Lake Michigan, so we're still in this band of clouds. But later today, we expect this to break up a bit, and the sun will pop out going into the afternoon. So our precipitation chance today, very light and very limited to our morning hours. Tomorrow looks dry. We'll see some sunshine. But take a look at our weekend. There's a really good chance for snow on Saturday, and even a few snow showers linger on Sunday. Here's a look at future track for today. We start off with clouds and even a few flurries falling out of that cloud deck, but by 5 o'clock this afternoon, decreasing coverage, so we should get into some sunshine, and then actually going mostly clear for a while tonight. Tomorrow, we'll start off clear with a lot of sunshine in the forecast Friday afternoon as well. By the time we get to Friday evening and night, though, we're going to see an increase in cloud cover. And there's that system that's going to be moving in for the weekend. Right now, the track of this system is such that we expect to see snow here in the Miami Valley. And it's going to fall through most of the day Saturday and even into Saturday night. Our snowfall amounts look highest as you head south. So southern Butler, Warren, Clinton counties, that is where we could have four inches or even more. Really, Richmond, Dayton, Springfield, two to three inches expected. And then the northern counties, maybe an inch uh, more likely on the higher end of that, around the two-inch mark. This is just uh, an initial forecast, which could change over the next couple of days as that system develops. So be sure to check back. Overall, the message to take away is that this could impact weekend travel. 29 degrees, our high today, partly sunny, breezy and cold with wind chills in the teens. Tonight will drop down to 18 as skies clear out a bit. And then tomorrow, a mostly sunny, seasonable day, a nice finish to the week with a high of 34. Saturday is when the snow moves in. We'll see highs near 32 and then Sunday 34, still the chance of a few snow showers there. Next week will dry out as we're heading back to school and work and temperatures will start to warm as we head through midweek.